Welcome to my channel. This is Ray Shape and I'm Chris Rea. Today we're going to work the shoulder muscle, which is this right here, which falls into three parts. The front, the side, and the rear deltoid muscle. But today we're going to do it a little bit differently. We're going to use these two dumbbells right here. Now we're going to isolate the shoulder. We're going to do first one shoulder and then the other shoulder in a separate fashion. Reason being, like that one shoulder can't overpower the other. We'll be using one at a time. We call this the isolated dumbbell shoulder routine. Our first exercise is called the Arnold press. Arnold press, obviously you heard of Arnold Schwarzenegger. Everybody who worked out heard of him. The Arnold press is different from a regular shoulder press because we're gonna begin this exercise with our palms facing us. In this fashion, just this way, and as we raise our arms, we supinate, we just turn our arms outward, just like this. We're going to do this exercise seated for two sets at 10 repetitions per set. Now we're gonna do another two sets, but this time standing. Now the standing on our press, we're gonna start this way. The reason why I like to stand as well is because while standing, we're gonna use more balanced and stabilized muscles. So we begin this exercise just like this, palms facing you, and as you raise the dumbbells up and down, make sure to supinate, which is turn your arms. We just finished four sets of the Arnold press. Two sets seated, two sets standing. The Arnold press works the overall deltoid muscle. Okay, now we're gonna do another set of the Arnold press, seated, but this time isolated. Isolated meaning we begin the Arnold press the same way palm facing you, but we begin with one arm, then the next arm. One arm, then the next arm. Do this up to five, then as soon as you get to five, keep one arm up, And just like this. So do a total of 10 repetitions of isolated Arnold press. Now we're going to do the same thing, but this time standing. Start to press the same way and keep one arm down and press with the other arm, then switch the arms. As soon as we get to five, we keep the dumbbell raised. Just like this. We just did two sets of isolated Arnold presses at 10 repetitions per set. Our next exercise is dumbbell side lateral raises. The lateral raises works the side of the deltoid, which is right here. We're going to begin, seated position, back straight, just like this. Do this exercise, which is a dumbbell side lateral at two sets at 12 repetitions per set. We're going to do the same exercise, which is a dumbbell lateral row, but this time standing up. We're going to do two sets at 12 repetitions of standing dumbbell lateral rows, just like this. We're going to do another set of seated dumbbell lateral rows, but this time isolated. We're going to begin by alternating the arms. First, I'm going to start my left. 10 reps on the right hand side, just like this. Then switch. Our next exercise is the same as the last, but this time we're standing. Do one set of that at 10 repetitions per arm, so that's 20 repetitions. Our next exercise is the bent over lateral raise, which works the rear deltoid, which is right back here. I'm gonna start off by bending forward, your chest practically touching against your thighs, and moving the dumbbells up and down just like this. For this exercise, do two sets at 10 repetitions per set. Our next exercise is the same as the last one, but this time we're gonna isolate the deltoids by using one arm at a time, just like this. Five reps first like this. Raise it just like this. Oof. Ah, wasn't easy. We just completed an entire shoulder workout, including the isolated system, all within less than 20 minutes. And we hit all three heads of the shoulder, which is the front the side and the rear part of the shoulder. I want you to do this exercise once or twice per week. Our food of the day is a low carb, high fiber English muffin. This English muffin is a great choice because each muffin contains 100 calories and eight grams of fiber. Thank you for checking me out and see my YouTube channel for additional workouts and workout tips. And don't forget to comment below and ask your questions on Facebook.